I wanted to show how to completely remove uh, Dragon 15 before you do Dragon 16 install. So apps and features. Oh no, it's not what I want. Apps and features. And uh, I'm going to sort by size. There's Dragon Medical. I'll never be able to uh, to use this again because they've turned off the uh, update server. So I don't have any choice about that. Um, if you're not sure you want to do this, then um, first thing you need to do is take a image of your computer. That way you could re-image your computer and uh, use it again later if you wanted to. Now, yesterday I did this. Uh, I spent two hours uh, figuring out how to completely remove Medical Practice Edition because when I installed version 16, it kept pointing to a medical vocabulary which wasn't... Uh, accurate anymore and so it would uh, keep the program from running now uh, what I've got the process I'm going through here the first thing you do is you uninstall it from your apps like any other program and you do it while you're connected to the internet and this will tell the activation server that is if you don't have medical practice edition if you just have straight version 16 pro or 16 legal or something like that it will tell it that you've uninstalled um, the program and it will free up an activation on another pc in my case they've turned it off for dragon medical practice edition version 4 because they want you to bring uh, to buy a subscription into to dragon one okay so that's done now the next step um is you go uh, i'll put this in the description um you go to S nuance and get this uh uninstaller so i'm going to open up a web browser and type that and it will immediately download the program now i can go to my downloads folder just click that and what this does is it uh, cleans up the registry there's hundreds of dragon 15 um, notations in the registry so this won't take a whole lot of time and then I'll show you one other uh, one other thing next that made all the difference in the world for me, uh, and that is to remove your previous Dragon 15 uh, voice files. So this is almost done. We'll give it another few seconds. All right, now uh, the Dragon Cleaner has completed. I'm gonna finish. Uh, now it wants me to restart, but before I do that, you need to clean the application data. There's more than one way to get to it, but here's my favorite way. I go to Folder Options, and then View, and I'm gonna put Show Hidden Files and Drives which I already had that checked. Then I'm going to open up my file exposure, uh, explorer, go into uh, drive C, go to users, and then click your name. In this case, that's my name. And then I'm going to go to uh, app data, local, nuance, and there's Nuance 15. So I'm just going to go back to Nuance and just get rid of that whole thing. Now all that app data is gone.
Let me just double check it. App data. Local. And nuance is gone now. And now it's all ready for me to uh, put in a a new um, a new version. Hope that.